Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about combining like terms, and we want to simplify each expression. So, if I was given this expression, 12r plus 5 plus 3r minus 5. Well, 12r plus 5 plus 3r minus 5, that's, um, I can rearrange as a commutative property, but I don't like to necessarily rearrange, um, until I made everything plus and negative, okay? Uh, I like to see it all as plus signs. I know you still can do it, but I prefer it. It helps me from making mistakes. So that minus sign, I'm going to convert to plus and negative. So I have 12r plus 5 plus 3r, and this one would be plus and negative 5, okay? Now, I know some people will disagree with me on that one. That's fine. Um, there's many ways to solve this problem. So now it's all addition. I can use the commutative property. I'm going to rewrite 12r, put the 3r next to it because they're like terms. This 5 comes out here, and now I have plus and negative 5. It comes out here. So let's double check if we have all of our terms together. 12r, yes. 5, yes. 3r, yes. Negative 5, right there. Yeah, fantastic. So now let's combine our like terms. 12r plus 3r is just 15r. And 5 plus a negative 5, well, 5 plus a negative 5 is just 0, right? They cancel each other out. And if you need to see that it's 5 minus 5, see it's 0, that's fine, whatever. Okay, but I think, I think we could do 5 plus negative 5 to just know that's going to be 0 without subtracting it. Well, 15r plus 0, well, adding 0 doesn't change anything. It's the additive identity, right? We add 0 to anything, it doesn't change. And so we're left with just 15r, and that is our final answer. So again, let's recap. We have 12r plus 5 plus 3r minus 5. Well, 12, we uh, wrote that minus 5 to be adding a negative. So now we have 12r plus 5 plus 3r plus a negative 5. And now we use a commutative property to write 12r plus 3r plus 5 plus a negative 5, making sure we brought everything down, which we did. And now we added together our like terms, 12r combined them, 12r plus 3r, which is 15r, 5 plus a negative 5, canceled each other out, so 0. And we know that adding a 0, being the additive identity, doesn't change anything, so we're left with our final answer of just 15 